All right, finally, Samsung has announced the release of One UI 4.0 Beta, and apparently, the registrations are open in the US, which will be followed by a few other regions soon. Now, just to get a glimpse of what we can expect on this iteration of One UI based on Android 12, this article from Samsung shares most details about the features of One UI 4.0. Samsung says with One UI 4, you get customization options at every turn. A wealth of theme options let you adjust the look and functionality of your device, giving you tools to configure your home screen, icons, notifications, wallpapers, and much more. Plus, redesigned upgraded widgets offer deep customization from visibility to appearance. You also get convenient access to a more robust and diverse array of emojis all in one place. So you can effortlessly navigate your options to enjoy richer communication experiences. This is really exciting as we can see there is a lot mentioned about the customization especially the home screen customization which we all have been waiting for. The current One UI 3 home screen has hardly any customization options whereas the upcoming One UI 4 we can expect a lot more especially the icon customization which has been missing on Samsung. Even the widgets are getting deeper customization options. Now, even though Samsung offers most of these customizations through its GoodLock modules, the availability of this app is limited to few regions and many Samsung fans across the globe are unable to enjoy these customization features. But now with Android 12, we should be able to enjoy deeper customizations on Galaxy devices. Samsung hasn't mentioned specifically about the Google's Material U feature. However, the customization features announced by them are promising. We can expect same or similar features here, which we all are waiting for. Further, Samsung has mentioned that the new One UI 4 also brings enhanced privacy feature and protection functions that make it easier for users to understand exactly how their data are being used to customize their settings and deliver a more personalized mobile experience. Indicators alert users to app, camera, and microphone usage so they can instantly disable permissions if they don't want to grant access. One UI 4 also expands on Android 12's permission options, allowing users to view their permissions history from the last 7 days, not just the last 24 hours. You can also check the current data usage of both your permissions and your applications. So there is a lot more focus on privacy and protection functions in Android 12 and we can expect the same here. Apart from these, I suppose Samsung will enhance its AR zone features as well. Let's wait and see that. This beta testing will go on for weeks and we can expect the stable versions hitting Galaxy S21 series soon and I'm still curious about the beta release schedules for Note 20 and S20 series. Fingers crossed. Anyways, that's all I wanted to share with you guys in this video. Thanks a lot for watching. If you're new on the channel, make sure to subscribe to watch some cool contents on Samsung Galaxy phones, Android applications, Galaxy watches and anything related to technology. Thanks a lot for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. I will see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.